All right, so you wanna buy the lease you're in. Great decision, it's a good used car to buy, it's the one you've been driving, but what's the best way to do it? How do you get it financed? Do you go back to the dealer? Do you do it on your own? I'm Adam, I'm the lease guy. I got 10 years of lease experience um, in the finance side of the leasing industry. I understand lease contracts, I understand how dealers work. I'm here to help, so let's get into it. So you're making the decision, maybe because you can't find the new car you want, um, or whatever, you love the car you've been in, you wanna buy the lease car you're driving, awesome. You wanna finance it like most people would, what's the best thing to do? Number one, do not take the car back to the dealership you got it from. It's a common misconception, you may think, oh, the dealer's gonna love me, I'm a repeat customer, I've been making all my payments on this lease, they know me, they're gonna give me a good deal, I'm gonna get it financed through them, and everything's gonna be great. That's not how the dealer sees it. So they want you to come back in, return that car, and buy a new one. As soon as they find out you're not buying a new one, then you're no longer a customer. That's gonna be the last chance they ever get to make any money off of you. They no longer own the lease car they sold you three years ago. So now they're just a middleman brokering financing. They're gonna add in as many dealer fees as they can. They're gonna make as much money off of you as they can this one last time. And they are sad that you're not buying a new car. So that is the perspective you need to understand. So how, what do you do? Well, if you're not taking it back to the dealer, real easy, just go to your own bank, go to your own credit union, use a financial institution you have a history with, get a used car loan, um, the rates should be pretty good right now, um, and just buy that car directly off a lease with financing of your own doing. Um, the dealership will not be involved, they can't add any fees, and you will save yourself a bundle. In my experience, the dealership is gonna add enough fees in to make the car cost what they would have resold it for on their used car lot to make the profit just like they were flipping a used car. So that residual value you had on your lease contract, they're just gonna add fees up to, to resell it like a, a, a dealer used car markup. So if you let the dealership be involved, they're gonna do what dealers do and they're gonna make money. So real easy solution, get your own financing. Just go to the link, get it done. The only thing with that, you may have to do your own title work, like a trip to the DMV, depending upon the state that you live in, but hey, if that saves you a thousand, two thousand, three thousand dollars in fees, um, I'll make a trip to the DMV all day long. So, like I said, my name's Adam. I'm the lease guy. I'm a leasing expert. I'm here to help you with your questions on the lease process, all the way through from beginning to end. I'm gonna make videos about topics like this that I think can be helpful. Please hit like, please hit subscribe, please come back. If you have any specific questions you'd like me to touch on, I'd be more than happy to make a video. Thank you so much. Happy holidays. I'll see you soon.